guys welcome back to the channel and this lab is little bit tricky so i request you watch the video carefully so first of all just log in with your credentials and once you're done with this just simply click on this checkbox and click on agree and continue now just simply search for the marketplace in the search bar and open this thing in new tab now just simply come back over here now what you have to do just simply search for the data plex api just wait and just simply search for the data plex api open this thing and here you can see cloud dataplex api open this thing in new tab now what you have to search you have to search for the data catalog api open this thing and here you can see google cloud data catalog api open this thing in new tab now just simply click on enable now just wait for this api get enabled And as you can see, both the APIs are enabled. Okay, now what you do, just simply search for the data plex. Click over here. Now just simply come on the task number one. Okay, and one more thing, keep remember your region. For me, the region is US East one. So you have to just keep remember your region because we need in latest step. Okay, so first of all, just copy this name. Make sure that you do not copy any extra space. Otherwise, you might face a unnecessary error. So just copy this name. Click on this get started then click on this manage option just wait click on this create option and paste the name over here like this okay now what was my region so my region was us east one so i'm going to choose that region like this you have to choose yours just simply scroll down and click on create now this thing is going to take a couple of minutes so just wait And it's finally done now just simply click on this name okay now what we have to do we have to just add zone so just simply click on this add zone now just simply scroll down copy this name for your zone make sure you do not copy any extra space and that full stop okay just copy this name paste over here like this no need to make any other changes just simply click on create it will take a couple of seconds and you are done with the task number one now what you have to do just simply come on the task number two copy this name copy this name just click on this display name then click on this add assist just wait and then click on this add and from here you have to choose the storage bucket make sure as a type you have to choose storage bucket okay now just paste the name which you just copy from the lab instructions okay now what you have to do just simply scroll down click on this browse option then click on this bucket option now here please pay attention first of all just copy this project id 
paste over here like this then click on this continue and from here you have to choose a region and you have to choose your region for me the region is us east one and it's already chosen for me so i'm not going to change for you it might be different so you have to just check that okay now just simply click on continue scroll down click on this continue and check this checkbox and choose the fine grains click on continue and create now just wait it will take a couple of seconds then click on select okay no need to worry about this error just wait and as you can see it will be vanished as you can see it's done now click on this done then click on continue just wait choose inherit click on continue and submit just wait and you are done with this task number two okay now just wait and it's creating now what you to do just simply click on this tag template come back over here then click on this create tag template now just simply scroll down come on the task number three copy this name copy that name scroll down paste the name over here again check the location for me the location was us east one so i'm going to choose that now it must be public then click on this add field scroll down a little bit and now just copy this name carefully copy that paste over here like this now for the type it must be enumerated like this now for the value just press capital y then click on add value then type capital n like this and then just simply click on done and click on create now just wait and as you can see tag template is created now please pay attention click on the search option just wait and here you can see in legs and zone option you can see customer engagement option just simply click on this checkbox then click on this table name called raw event data like this now just wait then click on this attach tags from here choose your template just simply click on ok just wait and from here you have to choose y and click on save and you are done with this lab okay if you just simply scroll up and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue if you just simply click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue sometimes lab take couple of minutes to update update a score so no need to worry about that okay now if i just simply come on here and click on this check my progress i will get a score without any issue and if i didn't get a score no need to worry just wait for a couple of minutes and you are done with this lab and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys.